Mac McClung, Osceola Magic. It's my third year. I really just try to get invested in just kind of each year making it a better year. Yeah, you know, you never know what to expect. You never know what the off season, what opportunity is going to come. I, I love this league. I love playing basketball. I want to be in the NBA. That's my goal, and, and that's why I'm here. Hopefully, I can make that step from here. But also, I'm enjoying my time as well. I mean, it was just, uh, it was a really a surreal moment. It's like, you know, beforehand I was I was trying to picture how it'd go, if it'd go great, if it'd go bad, and I was just trying to manifest, and it was like, once it happens, all that just kind of goes out the window, and it was just like, I don't know, me and my best friend, and he was there, we just looked at each other like, what just happened, you know? But it was, it was an incredible experience. You know, I think uh, there's a lot that goes into, you know, coming from the G League and I think a lot of that's the right time and the right opportunity and when that comes I'm, I'm just trying to be ready. Each year I'm trying to get better at something they say I wasn't good at. So um, I think you just keep applying that pressure until that opportunity comes. You know, this year I'm trying to, uh, you know, my first year in the league they said I couldn't pass and then they said I couldn't shoot. And then now this year I'm trying to be a defender, just trying to take away any excuse possible is my goal. And um, really just being, growing as a person and, and a player each day and then being ready when it comes. I definitely would agree that the mental is like, it's, you know, as my coaches say, it's four to one. I would say it's like 80% of the game is mental because everybody's athletic here. Everybody has talent, everybody has skill. Now, how can you, can you balance that every single night? How can you be consistent? And I think a lot of that's the mental. I would say just really just the word Dharma, just to do things because you love them, not because any expectation. Don't, I don't play basketball for a call up or a, um, you know, a certain amount of money I play because I love the game and I think to let go, uh, you know, that's an easy thing to say out loud, but really just um, enjoy your time and uh, I don't know, I would say use the word Dharma. I would say, yeah, don't, I mean, this is an obvious one, but don't compare your story to anyone else. And I would say the energy and your intention kind of um, determines your life you know how what you what why you do something and who it's for is is really big and I would say just like the biggest focus I have is just getting better and that's all I really care about I would say that's a, that's a those would be the things I would say